Hi guys, I am going to try something new today. I am going to take a carbon dioxide detector and configure it in such a way that whenever the carbon dioxide level goes above 20%, it opens a garage door and a window. So for producing carbon dioxide, we will need an old car and we will click on home and take a garage and a window. Now we have to configure them so we need a switch for that and for configuring all of them we need a server and I'll be needing a PC now we have to connect all of them to the switches so for connecting them to the switch we'll need a Ethernet cable I'll just connect them now they are all connected now we have to give a IP to the server so I'm gonna give 1.1.1.1 and this is 1.1.1.2 the window will be 1.1.1.3 the garage door will be 1.1.1.4 all done now we will go to the server go to config fast internet and give the IP address here and the default gateway all set up we will do the same for the PC sub 1.1.1.2 and subnet marks done the garage door same procedure okay oh right we forgot giving a IP to the CO2 director so it will be 1.1.1.5 all done now we'll just configure it to then all of them are connected <coughs> now we have to configure them so all has been set now we'll go to the server go to desktop and web browser and as we place the IP here I'll just quick check it This, the following will be shown because it is still not a registration server so first we have to make it a registration server for that we will be going to services IOE registration server on then go to desktop web browser and place the IP so here we have the registration server login page we have to create so I am gonna put the username as admin and password as admin it has been created now we are already inside now I have to configure all of them go to config global this is already done go to window config remote server username is admin part of password is admin connect 
it has connected do the same with the garage door give the server address username and password Now all has been done. We just switch it on. Okay, it's showing it's not on. It will take some time to switch on. As we can see, the light has been turned on, that means the CO2 detector is on. Now we'll go to the web browser, go to the registration server, login using our details. and we can see that all of this the alarm the garage door and the windows are all connected together for our reference we'll just rename them so that it can be easy for us we'll name this as garage says window okay okay all done so now we have to configure them now I'll go to conditions and add the condition I will name the condition as on now if CO2 level is, is more than equal to 20 percent then window on true and garage on true okay will add another condition as off if CO2 level less than equal to 20 percent not equal to it's less than 20 percent then window on false add action garage on false okay okay we have added the rules now we'll check if this works go to home we'll turn on the car as you can see the CO2 alarm is not working it's at 36 0.036 percent and it's not English that means the alarm is not working now I have to check why the alarm is not working so 
so I think there was a problem in the car so we'll just play salt and it will be off we'll go to the web browser login again admin admin sign in so now it, I can see that it's working so I'll just go to the conditions I'll do a slight change that is I just go and press the condition off if CO2 level less than 5% then window on true we will change it to false and another action garage on false ok because after CO level is below 5% then we, it is good for us to, for, to breathe so I'll, we just check if it is works I'll just press alt and turn on the car we can see the CO2 level increasing our condition is if the level is more than equal to 20 percent so we'll just see we can change the conditions from here if you want we just have to wait for it to go to 20 percent How about we add another card? That might help. I think my Cisco packet tracer is malfunctioning a bit. Sorry for the inconvenience. In just a minute. So I think it's working again. I just added another car. I'll just make the process fast by adding more cars. So I have checked the conditions properly. Now I'll just wait and see if it's working. So it has gone 19 and here's 20. Now yes, the see the garage door and the window has been open. And 
slowly the level is going below 5 let's see what happens once it, go, once it goes below 5 I'll just turn the cars off see the garage door and the window have been closed so the, which means the setup is working properly so that is all for today guys see you in the next video